G'day and welcome back. Okay, so today we're situated in the inside of my Nissan S15. Okay, now I wanted to discuss Kiichi, Suchi, Kiichi Suchia, I think that's how you say it. Um, he's 86. They did a trick for scuba where they go third and then he goes into the position where fifth used to be and now fifth is a gear in between third and fourth. So... I'm going to coin this as the poor man's um, close ratio. So they're happy with one, two, three, but then they want something in between three and four. So they replace fifth because they don't need it for scuba, so the short circuit. And then, so you go third, fifth, or what they call three and a half, then fourth. Now, I've got a gearbox on the bench, so let's go and have a look, and I'll show you why I think they did it this way. Right, we're over here at the bench now, and we've drawn our H pattern for the gearbox. So, one, two, three, four, five. Now, what they've realised is that scuba, you don't use fifth, because you just don't go that fast. It's a, The straights are short. Um, and the gap between third and fourth is relatively big, so there is a bit of an acceleration gain to be had by having a gear between third and fourth. Now, instead of just replacing the whole gear set, what they've done is they've just made one gear and put it into the position of fifth. So instead of buying five new gears, all they've had to buy is one and they pop it in the position of fifth and that's why you see Suchi he goes third into three and a half then over to fourth so that's why they've done it now if we have a look over here at the gearbox and this is the a six speed out of the S15 but for the purpose of this exercise let's pretend this is a five speed now a lot of manual gearboxes have the fifth speed or overdrive in the extension housing. Now what this means is we don't actually have to go inside the gearbox and pull out all the shafts to swap between a short track and a long track version of the gearbox. So we can put our short ratio onto overdrive where we don't actually need overdrive and that becomes three and a half. So let's pretend we've, we've taken fifth gear off. We're going to whack our new gear set on and now what we're going to get is the shorter ratio so now when we're shifting 3, 3.5, 4 and that'll give us a little bit of an edge on a short track so really fantastic way to swap between a long track or swap the setup between a long and a short track if you've only got one gearbox um, yeah so it's a bit of a it's a poor man poor man modification but you know what um, it works so you know that is a really innovative idea to get some cheap performance out of the car anyway um, I think I've said enough so we'll catch you guys next time